show. Hey guys, welcome back to another Clash Royale video. And let's go ahead and first open up our crown chest. Blah blah blah. Skip through that. One tornado. Okay, so that's fine. But I just battled once and it was an hour and nine minutes ago. But I just decided now to share it with you guys because I think it's the most epic comeback I've ever had. Like, ever throughout battling. Uh, some of you might think it's whatever, but I think it's a really good comeback. As you can see, I 3 star him and he 2 starred me. He is a level 11 and his cars are quite high leveled. So let's just go ahead and first watch this. So I'm going up against him. He has level 12 barbs and level 12 video horde. I didn't know this. So I fireballed his barbs, but we'll just get to that when we get to that. So first off, I start with the hog. His level 2 electro wizard only allowed my hog 2 hits. But that's still quite a bit of damage. Then my goblin gang takes care of that electro wizard. And he's gonna place a musketeer, but the goblin gang's still gonna get some chip damage. See, I was debating on whether to fireball it at the time, but I decided not to, and I was lucky I decided not to. There's the failed log that completely missed the hog. And then there's that zap, so I have to place my hog for that musketeer, or else it's gonna get a few hundred damage on my tower. Then there's his level 12 barbs, preventing my hog from getting a single hit. He also has level 3 princess, which he just placed down. And I hesitated on the fireball, because I was hoping I could get the princess, because I just I realized it was level 3. And that's pretty high. My log won't be able to kill it. So, I have to use a goblin gang to get the princess. But, and he didn't care about my goblin gang, which... Which was a bad mistake on his part. Because it got a lot of damage on his tower. And this is where he gets. he's going to he obviously get my tower. Because as you can see, I have no elixir. There goes his zap. My, his giant still has a lot of health. The tower goes down. He has level 11 video for My bad. I, I said level 12. And then because they decreased the electro wizard hit speed by 0.1 seconds. There's a lot of different electro wizard interactions now. And as you can see, there was one of them just a few seconds ago where the Electro Wizard couldn't kill that minion before it killed the Electro Wizard. So, I don't think they should have decreased its hit speed. But I was going to use the Skarmy on the Electro Wizard, but because of the fact that he has a princess, I have to use a, on that. And then I'm just going to ignore that Electro Wizard. Because... Uh, it's not going to get too much damage. I fireballed, didn't get anything. Bad mistake on my part. And I'm pretty much screwed up right now. As you can see, I said good game. Those three minions okay, are going to like completely destroy my tower along with that giant. And now the giant's at my tower. I'm trying to prevent the three star. My tower has 570 health left. There was the failed log that got nothing. And then I'm just hoping I can defend right now. And then there's 20 seconds left of the game. My tower, my king tower has 517 health left. There goes my hog and goblin barrel. And luckily that musketeer targeted onto the goblin gang and retargeted onto my skeleton army. So or else I was be, I was gonna be screwed. And there we go. Having the last push, minion horde. He doesn't have a zap or a spell or a fireball. And two one last second and. There we go, 3 star. So from us getting both of our towers down and King Tower having 93 health left, I managed to go ahead and 3 star that guy. So I just think that's a really epic comeback. And I think I'll also open up my giant chest. I've had it for a long time now. I was waiting for the heal spell, but they haven't released any news on the heal spell or any other card for that matter. Heal spells right here. Uh, the uh, the Night Witch and the Bass are right here. They haven't released when they're going to release them. So let's just go ahead and open up our Giant Chest. So we can clear up a slot. So we got an Executioner. 
31 wizards, and 272 minions. Not the most useful, but it's just a giant chest anyways. Let's just go ahead and donate the, lumber, the executioner we just got, and open up our clan battle chest. So gold, 9 elite barbs, 21 knights, 1 golem, 88 minion hordes, bombers, rare epics, and it's gonna be a rare. So 27 mega minions. So that's a decent uh, clan chest actually. It's only guaranteed 2 epics, but I got 3, so that's always useful. So I, th I'm gonna wrap up the video right here. Uh, if you guys do enjoy, and if you guys had an epic comeback like the one I had, be sure to tell me what it was in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in the next one.